is our uh, rotating liner. This is the, rot the driving gear. This is the shaft that sticks out of the, of the cylinder head. And you can see the, uh, the, the top of the liner. And you can see the, the uh, areas where the, the ceiling zone and the load support zone um, is located. Um, you can maybe you can see the some of the nine supply holes for the oil that's coming from under the rotating liner into the into the face seal. Um, yep, this one. Okay. Yeah. Well, one is probably enough. There are nine of them equally spaced, and you can see we have our, whole, our copper head gasket uh, with the correct uh, size. And now we're going to move to the cylinder head and. This is our primary ceiling ring uh, that rides on the rotating liner. The face, um, there's no wear, visible wear on the face other than the breaking micro scratches that happened the first day we ran it. You can see the springs, uh, 120 or 60 springs that give us the preload. The brass part are um, the uh, thrust bearings that define the axial location of the seal. And you can also see the heat shield right here and of course you can see a coating of uh, of uh, um, of the of the uh, of the carbon on the cylinder head and the heat shield from the um, from the outside um, okay